Hey folks, David from Default Sound here, and what you just heard was a demonstration of our main stage patch for the song Resurrecting by Elevation Worship. This main stage patch uses only main stage stock plugins, there's no external plugins required, and includes everything you need to perform this song live. The song is tuned to the original key and tempo of the song, but you can adjust the key or the tempo to match the way that your band plays the song if needed. And this patch has also been pre-mapped to our Sunday Keys main stage template. So if you're a Sunday Keys user, you can just drag this patch into your concert and it will pre-map to the extra section. Of course, you can use this patch in any other main stage three concert as well. What I'd like to do now is give you a little bit of a demonstration of the different sections of the patch and show you how to play the song. Let's take a look. All right, this song is in the key of D flat and it's a piano driven song. Uh, it starts off with a little bit of a piano riff, some octaves that are played in the right hand. It sounds like this. I'll do just the right hand and then I'll show you the left. So that's the little piano motif that starts the song off. If you'd like for there to be some piano and pad underneath it, then you can play octave bass notes in your left hand at the same time. And that looks like this. You can play the fifth in there as well if you'd like to thicken it up a little bit. So that's the intro and that phrase appears multiple times throughout the song. Uh, then for the verses, it's just very simple chords, kind of below middle C. So that's the verse and how it calls back to that little instrumental hook. And then uh, through the verse again, you can do a little bit of movement between uh, the notes here in your right hand if you'd like to. There's some of that on the album that you can mimic. Uh, then for the chorus, uh, it's, it's pretty straightforward. Uh, there's not a lot of extra piano work in there, but what you can do is bring the mod wheel up about a third of the way or close to half if you want it to be a little more intense. Uh, and if you want it to stay pretty true to the album, then you just play those low chords still. So again, just basic uh, one, five octave and a third for all of these chords. So on the chorus, it's and you can bring the mod wheel back down for the second verse if you'd like. Uh, if you need to do more or if you'd like to add more uh, for the choruses, then you can bring your mod wheel about halfway up uh, and you can kind of harken back uh, to that octave theme that happens during the instrumentals. So an example of what that might sound like could be like this. And 
it drops back down for the bridge. Uh, start to bring the mod wheel up as you build. As you bring the mod wheel all the way up, it brings in a synth arc, uh, and you can add octaves in here in the right hand as well if you'd like to add more. Fade the mod wheel back down as you need to decrease the intensity uh, and the dynamics of the song. All right, that's a little bit about this patch. I hope that you'll check it out and make it a part of your live keys rig. Thanks for watching.